new secure ETS project. We now want to create a new project in ETS that includes an IP router secure and an IP interface secure. To create a new secure ETS project, the following steps are required. First, create the project as usual. Make sure that the backbone medium is set to IP. Second, set project password. There is a strength check here, but no minimum requirements. So you can also enter one twice, just like I do it here. Third, now comes the insertion of the IP router secure into the ETS project. I do it for simplicity's sake in the topology. The Siemens IP router secure N14603 can easily be found in the online catalog by entering the search words Siemens 146 and 03 into the text filter. Please make sure to select the highest version of the application program. Currently, this is the 2. 4. As soon as you insert the router, you will be prompted to 5. Capture the FDSK. The easiest way to do this is to use the scan method of the QR code integrated in ETS via the camera integrated in every PC or laptop today. Alternatively, a QR code scanner or as an emergency solution, the keyboard. With the 30 digit codes, however, this is very laborious if you don't only have to integrate one router alone. A little trick that can make the capture much easier Take a picture of all the labels with your mobile phone, of course absolutely sharp, and then hold the photo zoomed to screen size in front of the lens instead of the original labels. 6. Adjust the additional physical addresses for the tunnel connections. As already known from the predecessors, when inserting IP devices with several tunnels, ETS creates physical addresses in ascending order, starting with the lowest free address. If you don't agree, you have to make these addresses visible now by clicking on the small number symbol on the router's main address and then change them manually as I do now. 7. Setting secure commissioning routing and tunneling. These options are already enabled in the default settings of the IP secure devices, so you don't have to deal with them if you want to load such devices secure from the beginning. 8. Remember the passwords. They are created automatically by ETS. They are absolutely hacker-proof. As you can see here, of course, it is possible to customize them and I'd like to do that for further project work and create a slightly simpler password for the exercise, the same for all tunnels. 9. For the IP interface secure, the same rules apply as for the IP router secure, as you can see in the animation. Ten. Capture FDSK in the ETS dashboard. Where can we find all project related FDSKs? We open the project settings. All device keys already registered for the project are stored in the security tab. In this view, further keys can also be entered, for example, for the IP interface inserted earlier. Many thanks for watching. We have now prepared the new project for the following commissioning. But before we do that, let's take a look at how an existing project needs to be processed in order to fully migrate to IP secure communication.
Stay tuned.